Hey guys, it's Tiffany Blue Pearls here with another video. So today, I got asked a few days ago to show my skincare routine. Which is kind of hard to do when you don't really have a set routine. I guess. I mean, I do face masks just whenever I feel like it. I put lotion on whenever I feel like it. I don't have like a set every night routine. But, um, except I always use my cellar water to take off makeup and that really leaves my skin pretty hydrated compared to my other makeup remover that I used to use which is this one from Mary Kay. You can see I've used a lot of it but it just it's really harsh on your skin so ever since I started doing that my face is not too bad anymore. So what I guess I'm going to do today is I'm just going to do a face mask review from the last video I went to Burke's Outlet, got some face masks from the cream shop. Love them. Love them. So the first thing I always do before I put on a face mask is I use my cute little headband that I use when I'm putting on my makeup. Pop that hair out and then bam. And see, now I look like a middle-aged mom. <laughs> That's so cute. <laughs> so cute. So let me get my garbage can out here because sometimes these face masks are really wet and I don't like playing that game. So we have this... Glow Up Skin Unicorn Mask. It's supposed to be printed like a unicorn. So... Okay. It says, Who says mythical creatures don't exist? Infused with rainbow pearl essences, the next best thing to unicorn tears. This face mask restores dullness to reveal skin that is quite literally gleams and sparkles. And you're supposed to leave it on for 15 to 20 minutes. No rinsing necessary. So we're going to try this one out today. Oh, wow, the inside's even holographic. Okay, that's cute. That's cute. That's cute. That's cute, cream shop. Okay, you got me. Oh, my God. It's, like, sopping wet. Ugh. Oh, God, it's dripping. It's dripping. But that's what helps it stick, I guess. Oh. Okay, let's put this on. Oh, good Lord. Okay, I'm gonna have to use my mirror. I can't do it in the camera monitor. I've got to use my mirror. And there we go. Do I look like a pretty unicorn? Am I a pretty unicorn? <laughs> This looks creepy, honestly, but it feels really nice. Like, it's nice. It already feels hydrating. It's got a cooling effect. I love it. Okay, so I'm going to set my timer for 50... Well, I'm going to set it for 20 minutes. And then we will be back. And I'll do a check-in every five minutes or so. So, stay tuned. Okay, it's been about five minutes. Uh, this face mask really doesn't fit my face shape, which is odd because the cream shop never, like, I never have that problem because, I mean, look how the eyes are going way up here, which I guess it does make it look more like a unicorn, but still. I kind of smoothed it out. I'm looking good. It feels nice. I just can't talk much because, like I said, it doesn't really fit my face shape. And I've been trying to, like, adjust it a little more, but it's not really doing much like adjusting wise but it still feels nice so i'll probably not check in anymore because it's not really changing anything it's just a sheet mask and then i will come back and do my final thoughts okay it has officially been 20 minutes so and it's starting to dry which means i mean it's starting to peel like it's not sticking like it was so let's just take it off Okay, that's creepy. So creepy. Okay, and it says to pat in or to rub in anything left over. Oh, wow. My forehead. I don't know if you can see it on my fingers, but it is still slick. Rub it down the neck. My face is a little red, but I don't think it's from that. My face is always a little red. So, oh. Well, there we go. That's what it looks like right after the mask. Hmm. 
I'm going to give it about mm, 10 more minutes, see if anything more sets in, and then I'll do my final thoughts. Okay, so it has been about mm, 10 minutes since I took the mask off. Some of the redness has gone down, but my face is always really red, so I can't really blame the mask for that. My face, it looks brighter, it feels tighter, which it didn't say anything about tightening, but it feels feels good. It feels really good. I'm definitely glad. That was definitely worth $4.99. Uh, so there we go. That's my skincare routine. Like I said, I don't have something that I do every night other than my micellar water. That's it. But uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and let me know down in the comments below what you'd like to see me do next time. I love you very much, and I will see you. Mwah.